What's good? It's your boy Sheen. Bless. And we are jumping back into Arcane, episode two, season two. First episode was wild. We seen an attack on Piltover or the upside. So we already know what type of season this is gonna be. It's gonna be full out war, a lot of loss, and you know, probably some character development. For the most part, I think we're just gonna see just the up ramp of war and you know what that entails. So can't wait to see that. If you guys want to get a lot more content from us you can head over to the patreon and check the patreon out we have exclusives that aren't making its way over to youtube or weeks ahead and content over there all those reactions are uncut so if you want all that click the link in the description to the patreon head over there and sub up because you are missing out over there but without further ado let's jump back into arcane let's get it well it's all going to shit just like when Vander shoved off. Except this time, you aren't here to put it all back together. <laughs> Could someone put all those holes in you? Who did? Yeah, she, she had a fucked up life, though. Before it broke everything. Dang, I had this. She used to say a lot, her and you. Always bossing me around. Now it's so quiet. He did care for her, though. We can't even cap. Have you had enough? Autumn is dead. Yeah, he died. She died. Go. No. Oh, yeah, yeah. Everybody fighting for that leadership. Oh. So they got the Majin Buu tattoo? Them boy making moves. Oh. Jinx are under him. Damn. Boy, Loki look like her a little bit when she's a kid. Who is that little kid that? Why are they chasing him? Gosh. You can you feel it? That buzzing behind your eyes? They could all boom. Yeah, that was hard. Yep, that's me. You ever need a curse a sibling or a family or a society? My card. Already <laughs> dead inside. He's staying with her. I don't care about none of that. You just saved me. I wonder why fat brains like you always wind up working for grunts like me. No, uh, never. You only use half your head. You never do nothing. Go took hold of the lanes with his bare teeth. Margo and Cross can buck all they want, but in the end, I'll be the one smiling. He got two mechanical arms. <laughs> you, you go on ahead. Report back. No, oh, he's send me a, in. Yeah. Anything, boy. Fuck out of here. <laughs> his eyes. The scientist. I said, did the scientist do that? Cause he had that green, that green stuff. <laughs> he's done. You see his eyes. I know you're all fantasizing about sawing each other's heads off. Turf wars have to stop. These two have been the aggressors. I've only defended my interests. Playing coy doesn't suit you, love. Topside is the real enemy. Us killing each other is playing right into their hands. They outnumber us four to one. That's before all the recent casualties. But they don't know the first thing about fighting in the fissures. Yeah. But I got a different solution. We give them jinx. That's all they really want. We don't hand over our people. We? You don't do much anything anymore, do you, Magpie? You help me put a bow on Baby Blue for our friends upstairs? I'll cut you a brand new puncher, top of the line, all the fixings. It's the last offer you're gonna get. What well, fried off of that shit? No cat. The good stuff. Yeah, knock her shit off. And that's crazy that even though 
she don't get along with Jinx, she's still not willing to give her up. I can't believe you're dead, and I'm still mopping up your messes. Jeez, lady, you crazy? Oh my gosh. You here to finish me off? Haven't I done you enough favors? About now, he'd have me all over the lanes, running his collections. Building his weapons. Making his deals. Exploding his enemies. He dips out. Damn. The whole world flips over. So that's Jinx's new Vi right there. And Vi got a new powder. Everything we built. The hell we supposed to do now? Watch it all burn. She's scary, bro. She got no rationale to her ever. Victor. What? She's inside of there too? Victor. Could you imagine that though? Was a full robot. Or whatever he is. His whole body go walk. A superhero. He is the hex tech. I was gonna say that person that saved Jason, his mom. Basically, he turned into that. I think. Victor. My God. What am I? His voice. That's not the same person. You must be cold. You don't feel nothing. Literally. No, I don't think so. A recursive impulse. Unpleasant, but cold isn't its name. The Hex Core. Victor, it saved you. Uh, somehow it, it adapted to your injuries. He's fried if he thinks that that saved him. Yeah. You promised to destroy the Hex Core. No. Don't you see? Heimerdinger was wrong. We were wrong. No, he wasn't. She had such dreams. Um, uh, he's supposed to go on a date or some shit. My place was always here, in the lab, with you. We'll make this right, together. I must say goodbye to this place now. To you. Our paths diverged long ago. It was affection that held us together. Where are you going? Goodbye, Jace. You mean woke up, grabbed that book, and left? Still, we don't know what that John did to him. What a change in his brain and everything. We're gonna have capacity issues soon. And there's the security risk. We're not turning people away. We finally get rid of Silco. Just so a new one can take his place. He could have killed Jinx too. Oh, this is quite troubling. That tree means so much. It's our food, fresh air. If there is a means of preservation, by golly, we'll find it. Them two together is crazy. No okay. cat. Nobody about to go steal some notes. I swear he a ninja. Ninja kid. We got baby shoes. Oh my gosh. Let's chase them. Professor. Yes, of course. This is my new pupil, Echo. Echo, my former pupil, Jace. Hmm. Hmm. Ah, no way, Echo's a gangster. It matches the corruption we saw on the plants we tested with the hex core, but where did you say you found this? Deep in the underground. Did any of the plants survive? They weren't what we were trying to save. How could it be there and here? No cap. Where's Victor? Go to the Undercity. Where's that guy? Got a fucking ratted him out. Vander's old friend. Be ass up in. So shit that was knocking them out. Yeah. 
Let's fly. That look crazy how they did that. Oh my gosh. She went to the spot they always went to. That suit look crazy. She can't do it either. What the fuck? She's still breathing that shit in. She definitely wants to pass out. Those people following her too. Ooh. Yeah, she's hurt. Damn. Right through their fingers. You must be part eel. Draw back you long range types. Me? I'm the kind of guy who likes to get in close. I wonder if Silco even saw that. Twice. When he met me, and when I killed him. Whether I'm pulling the pin or not everyone who gets close to me dies. You're the kind of guy who likes to get in close. She's crazy for that. So beautiful. In the sleep. It's over with now. Yeah, you see, you put the color blue and yeah. pink in that zone. Oh my gosh. Everybody got them arms. Blue kid through that. Mm hmm. I read him so swift. Yeah, what? <laughs> he got that look in his face too. Yeah. His arm is crazy. Arms. Oh my gosh. Remember they show boot for one of them. Yeah. Uh, now nah, his arms and legs are crazy, though. Oh, put his arm off. Now nah, he gonna have to That's run. Wait, 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 wait! There's a deal to be struck here. You forget, Smeech? You already made your last offer. Oh! That mm. arm is fucking great. Oh, he's different. Oh yeah, he's done. The other arm Tell me, who's a funny looking rat now? Marsha wins. He's famous. <laughs> yo, what the fuck is that John doing to him? Nah, yo, Jinx is actually a genius though. You could have just let me eat it. Haven't I done you enough favors? I didn't ask you for this. It was something I could fix. What are you planning? To finish what's left of my family. So she's seen her with, with uh, Caitlyn again. Yeah, but she actually with her now, like, she had to force her. Yo, kill him, bro. Sell as well. You boys need to need that that shimmer. You know, just need them drugs. They probably can't even cut him. Yeah, they can't cut him. That's pain. You got that shit like he a prophet. No cap. <laughs> this is a god, bro. Watch it heal him. 
But will it turn him turn him into something like him? Cleaned him up. Definitely did healing. <gasps> what the f And those are those same patterns they was talking about. They was on the tree. And that's why I'm I let next. him down there. I'm next the hill all He can over. clean it up and they might not need to go to war with them. If that if that took that much energy, it's gonna take him Dude, weeks, months to save everything. He is like the shit that saved Jason his mom. Yeah. Cause it teleported though. Nah, I see that I'm bound down. Yeah, too. I need you to fix me. I'm next. Nah, you said that that way is a profit. But uh, I let the staff and shit. Go teeth and shit straight. Oh. God. But he was always passionate about the Undercity, like, even though when him and Jace was, like, getting into their stuff, he still was like, yeah, don't disrespect where I'm from. Because Vi and them saw him the way he was. He turned them shits into monsters. Yeah. What the f- You see how fast it spread? Heart is still beating, man. That boy about to make the ultimate monster. All right, y'all. That was the end of episode two. That episode was also amazing, man. I'm loving the animations to this series. I loved it before. It helped even more this season, this season around. But the character development they're they're giving Victor right now is awesome because it was like he had a role within season one just being like the partner of jace but you could always see that they were planning to have him be something big within this series but we just didn't know what it was but now we see that he's basically like the i don't want to call them prophets but he was basically like the mage or the magical person that saved jace and his mother once he understands how to use it more he's going to be the strongest person around we got to see Jinx now, and Jinx is working with Savika. And what I was saying during the reaction is that Vi found the a new powder, because powder isn't powder anymore. She's Jinx. So now Vi has that thing that was missing in her life, I guess you could say. And then now with Jinx working with Savika, it's like she has that strong sister figure that's protecting her again. It's gonna be awesome to see when they clash again. Animations that they have so far within episodes, especially with the fighting, I feel like is very different than a lot of stuff that we've watched or watched at all. Vi is on the path that she is on. It makes sense though. Like I said during the reaction, she doesn't have anywhere else to go. I feel like Vi wants to find like a middle ground with them, but I don't understand or think there's a middle ground for them because of how Jinx is. It's one way or the highway, and then also with Caitlyn on her side, Jinx killed her mom and also other counselors and stuff too. So I don't think that she's gonna be able to get over. Obviously, that hole that was opened or created due to Jinx just going off the rails like she did. I'm excited to see where they go from here. Shout out to the young boy though that joined Jinx. I feel like he's gonna play an important role as well because I don't really think anybody's gonna account for him helping her in a way that he did or will so if you enjoyed the reaction make sure you like the video comment below us on your thoughts and subscribe on the bell kind of so you can notify when we drop these videos we appreciate y'all thank y'all so much for supporting us happy to be back with the arcane but until the next video the kids reacted